Oh, we had to plan a funeral for a five-year-old. Here. She loves dogs. Oh my goodness, it's the sweetest thing. Friday evening, her mom's boyfriend, 37-year-old Ryan Burge, was babysitting her at the Madison Park Apartments in Northeast Vancouver. Paramedics were called, and when police arrived, they found Hartley unconscious with severe head trauma. Burge initially told them she hurt herself after throwing a tantrum, but her injuries were so bad, she died at the hospital. Her Aunt Whitney Lugo is distraught. You know, she's five years old. Um, she didn't have anyone with her from our family when she passed away. Um, you know, so it's just scary. She's probably scared. This is Ryan Burge. In 2007, he was charged with arson and sentenced to six years in prison for lighting his duplex on fire, hoping to cash in on insurance money. Now he's charged with second degree murder and Hartley's death. Her aunt says she had never met her sister's new boyfriend, who has now changed their family forever. I just wrapped her Christmas present. You know, it's like it's sitting on my counter. She just had her birthday party um, two or three weeks ago. You know, she just turned five. You know, we planned on having Thanksgiving, Christmas. Her family remembering a girl who always made them laugh. Fun and adventurous and always moving, always moving. <laughs> There is a GoFundMe now set up in her uh, in Hartley's name to help out her mom with expenses. We posted that link on our website at KGW.com. Just awful. All right, Devin Haskins live in Vancouver for us. Thank you. We are going to continue to track this story. We'll be in court next week when Ryan Burge makes his first appearance. Stay with us on air and online to stay up to date with this story and others.